Anyway, so your name is Mike Chisholm. Mike Chisholm. I had that. And where are you from? Idaho, Pocatello, okay. Idaho. Okay. And how did you hear about the event? Oh, I've been involved since almost the inception. Maybe about six months after it, or, or Oath Keepers began. Oh, so you've been with Oath Keepers this long? Okay, yes. cool. And and so I'm the moderator for the whole state of Idaho. Nice, excellent, cool. And so you 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 came down to support yes. the the police officers here. You bet. Cool. You bet. Awesome. It's nice to have you know that you're 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 standing up for your freedom. As you are. Right. Everybody now, are you a um, first responder military or retired military ex cop? Okay. So. And and how do you feel? That, what's the what's it like the community and the policemen's uh, community, so to speak, for um, the oath keepers? What how are they? What's the reception been for you? For me personally, up where I'm at, where the, the local law enforcement is really around oath keepers. They're they're I mean, they're they're, 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 they're embracing it. They're yes, embracing yes. it. Okay. In fact, the chief of police and I have spoken many times. We've sat. In, he's invited me into his office, and and then when he had a new officer sworn in. Uh, he invited me to come on over. Nice. So we, we have a really good relationship. Excellent, excellent, excellent. And That's I really also cool. Run a, 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 from 8.30 to 9.30 on Wednesday nights. It's called Wednesday Night Live. It's on PBS. I run the, the, the channel. And we have guests on, and we discuss various topics from anything from political to how to prepare canned foods. So. Okay, because I also represent the Native American Church. Okay. And back in 2004, the Native American Church, the the state of Utah, raided them, stole 16,000 peyote buttons. And what they did is they went all the way to the Supreme Court of the state of Utah, which has the strictest drug laws in the country. Yes. And they had a unanimous dismissal of the charges. They wanted to put the medicine man in prison for the rest of his life. So they dismissed the case, said anyone can join the Native American Church. What that means, you don't have to be a, a, a have Native American... Uh, census card or whatever right. to be the be in the church. So what does that mean is that as such, belonging to the Native American church, anyone can join the Native American church and you have the right to do Native American sa uh, church sacrament, which is peyote, marijuana, ayahuasca, and, and magic mushrooms.